Um, so uh, the reason I would recommend web, using Web 2.0 tools is the, for two reasons. One of them is mainly pedagogical and one of them is mainly psychological. So the pedagogical reason is that more and more I'm recognizing that learning happens in a social way. That is, uh, you don't learn something by reading it, but you learn something by talking about it with somebody else. Of course, that can happen in the classroom, but it's much more exciting and it also gives a bigger impression if somebody from outside the classroom also talks to you about it using some of these social media tools. So that's the pedagogical reason. Um, I, I could also say more about it because if you are trying to communicate something that you're learning to somebody else and whether that person is in the classroom or outside the classroom, then that means you have to think out loud. And so actually showing your thinking processes is also something that really helps to embed the learning. And the second reason, the psychological reason, uh, is simply that getting an audience which is not just your teacher is a really powerful motivator. So instead of uh, writing an essay on the causes of the Second World War um, and getting a grade for it from your teacher, it actually much more um, worthwhile if you share your impressions of the causes of the Second World War and then maybe you get somebody from a country that was involved on the other side, if I can put it like that, and to give their perspective. I know the Second World War is a long time ago now, maybe that wasn't the best example, but you do get um, much more motivating uh, communication when you try and involve an outside audience. I think that many teachers are probably very scared about opening up uh, their classrooms in that way, and in fact it's not either or. Uh, so you can actually invite a small, motivated, but specially chosen audience. Um, for example, only two days ago, there's a teacher in the US that I know, and the, she announced that she had just got her fifth grade students to write some blog posts and they would love to have some comments. So I wrote some comments, I read a few of them and I wrote some comments. So she was reaching out to people she knew. Um, rather than just making it a sort of open invitation, which uh, some teachers might be afraid of. So those are the two main reasons why I would um, uh, recommend it.